Hey YouTube, that Brady chick here. Don't mind my scrubs hanging up behind me. That's just for placement because I'm starting my winter semester very soon. So yeah, and my fall semester literally just ended last week. So fast paced programs, what can you do? Anyways, um, I just wanna show you guys how I kind of stimulate my hair growth a little bit when my real hair is out like it is now first of all i like to leave my hair in twists so that i can kind of expose my scalp and i get one of my go-to oils whether it's wild growth hair oil or my jamaican black castor oil i usually get the small one because it's cheaper right um oh yeah and i get the extra dark one because i feel like it's more potent than the other ones and that's what we want we want one with the real good up good up ingredients i don't have much of the wild growth hair oil left so i'm just going to put some of my castor oil inside of it oh also i put some like essential peppermint oil in this as well like just three drops i put in there so yeah just to let y'all know so I just added a little bit of castor oil in there, mix it a little bit, and then we're going to apply it to our scalp. This is just excess that was on the side, but yeah, I'm not trying to waste product. So, all right, and now we're ready to go in and apply. I like to start from the front of the hair and work my way back. So it doesn't have to be perfect but try to get as many areas as possible. I think this might be a little too thick for the bottle, but it's okay. Okay, so I feel like the oil is pretty much fairly distributed at this point. And don't forget your edges. Right, because you want your edges to remain intact as well. And now I'm going to take my Christmas gift that my boyfriend got me, which is like a scalp massager. I'm going to use that and massage my scalp since the oil is in there now. So I like to just press on it and then go in a circular motion. Okay. Just concentrating it on the hair. It's good to do scalp massages for like at least a minute per section, but honestly, who has the time or the patience? Not me, not right now. <laughs> Catch me on another day, just not today. Uh, so I'm just gonna, ooh, that actually feels really good. I like the fact that this scalp massager takes all the work off of my hands, having like my fingers having to massage it. Cause sometimes that can get a little bit tiring and I feel like the scalp massager just relieves that pressure that would have been placed on your hands. Also, if you want to know how I did this look with my twisted beads, you can refer to the link above and watch that video. I don't know what else to tell you. I really like it because like the beads give it some weight so it's not just, you know. I mean, to be honest, my hair would have been mobile anyways because I just find that when natural hair is weighed down with products, it tends to be pretty mobile in my past experience. But I feel like the beads add a nice little touch to it, it adds more weight, and it's just different. You know, I haven't worn beans, beads since I was a kid, so it's a nice little change. But yeah, I think I'm pretty much done. I hope. Yeah, 
yep there's not much to it where you're just like kind of massaging the oil further into your scalp so you can kind of stimulate some growth there I think pretty much the secret to natural hair growth is just scalp massages and oil application as well as technique of course you have to be gentle with your hair you have to wash it on a scheduled basis you have to do regular trims uh, which I still kind of fall short on oh um, what else protective styling you know you can twist your own hair or you can go and get it done via box braids or wigs or weave as long as you're protecting those ends you're good for me right now I'm on um, winter break so I just decided to play with my hair a little bit this is my little break from box braids and I decided to twist it up and put my beads on because why not <laughs> why the heck not so yeah that's pretty much all I have for you guys to try do you guys want to see the back yeah, I hope the scalp massaging didn't mess it up a little, but yeah. Hopefully it looks fine. But anyways, yeah, thanks again for watching, guys. And thank you, Boo Boo, for my scalp massager. Really appreciate it because I feel like I kind of needed something like this just to give my hands a break because this is how I used to scalp massage before, just with my fingertips. And honestly, I already feel it in my bicep. <laughs> You know, and I don't really welcome that kind of pain when I'm doing my hair. So I prefer to just relieve the pressure from my fingers and place it onto this little device here. Because it's a lot easier. But yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. That was just me scalp massaging my hair and applying some, a bit of an oil concoction, I guess, to it as well. But yeah, thanks again for watching, guys. And always remember, natural hair grows. Woo! Don't you forget it. Bye. Oh, 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 the pretty girl.